Hello there. Wow. Perfect. Wonderful. Well done. Okay. What is up everybody, the Nintendo Beast here. Welcome back to Let's Play Animal Crossing New Horizons here on the Nintendo Switch. Uh, let me, real quick, I still got my Festivale gear on. I gotta clear out my litter, or my litter box. My mailbox. <laughs> oh my god. I am, I'm a new cat owner, so that's why. I, I, I can't blame that for being the reason why I just said clear out my litter box, but... Um, I'm gonna blame it anyway. Okay, uh, let me, I have, like, empty pockets right now from recording, uh, a video, a, uh, maze video, or an obstacle course video. So I got letters from, like, everybody. Valentine's Day letters. Let's do it. See what everybody got me, real quick. I should have chocolate heart, a heart shaped bouquet, a chocolate heart, chocolate heart, and a heart shaped heart shaped bouquet. Fun fact, spoiler alert: I'm actually allergic to chocolate, so none of my villagers know me clearly. Um. Are all these heart-shaped bouquets pink, though? Or red, or... What's the dealio? Like, are they all the same color? No, okay, so they come in different colors. That's kind of cool. Because I know I have one inside on that I ordered myself. So are all these chocolate hearts the same? No, okay, so they come in different colors, too. That's kind of cool. These are things we didn't know. Cool. So I got three. Every single one that I got in the mail was a different color. That's kind of cool. Thanks, everybody. Thanks to all my villagers for that. A woodland wall. Okay, cool. So we got a new do-it-yourself recipe today, too. We're off to a good start. Off to a good start. Let me see what that looks like. That's pretty cool. Looks like I have Nook Miles to claim, too. Pity party. What? Oh, enjoy some bonus Nook Miles to commemorate the creation of your first pit. Uh, just make sure you don't fall victim to your own handiwork. Okay, so that was the pitfall thing. Interesting. Okay, so that's all of them. Um... <laughs> So yeah, so moving forward, similar to what I'm doing with my Animal Crossing City Folk Let's Plays uh, moving forward, what I plan on doing moving forward here in Animal Crossing New Horizons is focusing more of my energy on... Hold on. Why is February 27th important? Because it's when we celebrate the birth of our friend and neighbor Rosie. Let the birthday festivities begin, but not before... February 26th, we celebrate John... <laughs> Uh, yes. But anyway, not important. Uh, what I'm gonna dedicate my time here in my Let's Play episodes from here on out, um, not entirely, obviously, but more so to catching bugs and fish that I haven't already caught, uh, and critters. But, um, yeah, let's see. So we got some, we got a bunch of fish to catch still here in New Horizons this month. One of which is uh, going away after this month. So we got to catch it before March. And then we also have the mole cricket uh, in the bugs. That's the only bug this month that's out that I haven't caught yet. Um, but for fish, we've got the pop-eyed goldfish, the ranchu goldfish, the stringfish, and the blowfish. So the blowfish actually goes away next month, like I said. So let's find out. Let's start with the blowfish, shall we? Um, let me pull up... <laughs> This fandom page here. And... Blowfish. We're gonna get the lowdown on the blowfish. Or the fugu. If I pronounce that correct. So it's a medium-sized shadow. Ocean, November to February. 
Time of day, 9 p.m. to 4 a.m. Okay, so I actually can't do that right now. That'll be a nighttime excursion, so we'll we'll come back to that one. Uh, Popeye Goldfish. Let's start with the Mole Cricket, actually. So I'm pretty sure the Mole Cricket, that one's available all day, every day. Let me run inside and also get my real tools. Because I still have not grabbed all my real tools from uh, my storage here. <laughs> Here we go. So get my fishing rod, my net, get my golden slingshot, my wand, my vaulting pole, my ladder. I think that's everything I, I need right now, right? <laughs> All right, so let's get back in the action here. It's been a long hiatus for me. I think it's been like two weeks since I've last played. Uh, and for whatever reason, um, I record all these Let's Plays kind of in a row. And for whatever reason, uh, the audio has been getting screwed up. Or got screwed up the last two episodes for City Folk and uh, Population Growing on GameCube. I think it's... I don't I don't know what happened. Like, the audio from the game is too loud and my voice is too quiet. I don't know what happened. Hopefully the mixing is correct. Uh, I have to adjust the settings randomly. I haven't had to adjust the settings in so long. And now all of a sudden, randomly, something went... Something's different in the software. I don't know. Anyway. We're on the hunt for a mole cricket. So throw that up there right now. Mole Cricket, we are on the hunt. And then we'll get into these fish. I'm using a flimsy shovel right now like an idiot. So there's the golden... The golden hole. Mole Cricket. I'm trying to be kind of quiet and not talk as much while I try to find a Mole Cricket. The noise they make, I just caught one in City Folk 2 on the Wii. And the noise they make is like so droning and ambient, it's kind of hard to. Like you can miss it very easily just by not paying attention. That was our pitfall maze, or obstacle course that we made. Oh, what's up, Candy? Hey, um, I know this is, like, out of nowhere, but I want you to have my simple knit, simple knit sweater. If you don't end up using this, it's totally fine if you give it away. I'm just glad to get it off my hands. Okay, thank you, I guess. Wait. I don't know if I should go back there. Like into backyards. Maybe I'll run behind these buildings quick. Not hearing anything. Thus far, so 
so let's run it over to the orchard area. I don't think they can be under all these weeds. So I'll pick up these weeds for no other reason than to uh, offer these mole crickets more space to adventure. God, there are so many weeds. I have to clean up my island. I've been AFK for too long. Not hearing anything. ensnared by my own uh, setup here. I'm not hearing anything. Now it did take me a, a while to find the mole cricket in uh, City Folk too. So I'm not going to get discouraged when I don't hear it right away. I've definitely heard mole crickets and I just didn't know what they were before in New Horizons. Oh, okay, so he's here today. Look, you want to help out, bud? Help me find a mole cricket. I don't want to clean up all this today, but... I'll clean up a little bit of the weeds. And I'll try to clean up the rest of it off camera. Uh, or I'm not boring my audience to death trying to find, trying, trying to clean up all the weeds. <laughs> Crap, I heard like a noise and I turned out to be just garbage. A garbage snowflake. There's a balloon out here, though. Yeah. Had to think about what the heck I was doing there. Crap. There she is. Okay. A fairy tale dress. Yay! Just what I wanted. shovel back out here. If there's a mole cricket anywhere in or on this island, I will find it. Can they be on the beach? I don't know if mole crickets can be on the beach. I don't think they can.
Oh god. What's up, Eloise? I'm kinda doing something. I have a teensy favor to ask. My cyber shades. Be a deer and take it off my hands. Alright, so people are just giving me free crap today. This spring cleaning or something, I don't know. I hear it. Where is it I am hearing it? Is it across here? Yes, it is. I'm gonna need you to get out of my way, bird. It's right here. There it is. Crap, it's gonna go in the frickin' river. Got it. Mole cricket. Caught. I was so scared it was gonna jump in the river or something. Alright. So let's cash that baby in. So that's, a, that's one bug off the list. Blathers, take this mole cricket before I accidentally sell it. Okay, so mole cricket. Done. Let's find out about the pop-eyed goldfish, shall we? Pop-eyed goldfish. Blathers? I'm still wearing my festive alley outfit. I, I, I noted it. I commented on it a second ago. I still haven't changed, though, because I'm an idiot. So let's see what we can, uh, let's see how many things we can check off this list today. So the, the mole cricket is done. Uh, no, thank you. I don't care. I don't care. And you don't want to tell me about it. <laughs> so 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. Okay. So it's, it's out. Uh, okay. This one's out all year round too. Uh, it's tiny and it's in a holding pond in New Horizons. So we're looking for tiny fish in the holding pond or in one of these holding ponds. So let's do it. We still got time. It's only two o'clock. We got two hours to catch this thing. <laughs> Not going to go that long uh, in the episode, but I'm also looking for the, the ranchu goldfish. So there's a pond there. Go my heart pond. Anything back here? Looks like there's nothing in any of these ponds. Which is a wee bit discouraging. Um, especially since I know for sure that I definitely saw... Um, a little shadow in one of those ponds before now. So I feel like I missed my opportunity. But I think this is considered a holding pond up here too. It's a big thing. It's definitely not a freaking goldfish of any variety, but the uh, the string fish. I'm not sure. Crap! I, I blew it. Anyway, so let me let me check the string fish too, because I need the blowfish, which is ocean, I believe, and not available right now. The string fish and the ranchu goldfish and the Popeye goldfish. So how about the Ranchu Goldfish? 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. as well. Location Pond. Okay. Size unknown. What the heck? Inc oh, shadow size is small though. And then the Stringfish. That's the other one I'm missing, right? Yeah. Stringfish is the river is a river fish, so that wouldn't have been it. 4 p.m. to 9 a.m. So that's not out right now either. So we, we, we're looking for goldfish. Specifically these two goldfish. Um, which is a small shadow and a tiny shadow. So the Ranchu goldfish apparently is a little bit bigger than the Popeye goldfish. There's a, a 
fish over there. I was gonna say, I'm all for like scaring away fish that don't seem to be what I'm looking for, but what happens... What happens if there are no fish? So that's a bitterling, right? Yeah. I'll just run back and forth between these two ponds, I guess. And another mole cricket. This sucks. You know what? I'm gonna cheat. I'm gonna build more holding ponds. That's what I'm gonna do. To make it easier, maybe, to find, uh... But also... I keep saying this, let me change. Waterscaping permit, let's, let's build some holding ponds, shall we? I'm gonna hit, I'm gonna hit a mole cricket pretty soon. That was it. That was that was the one with the mole cricket. Crap. Alright, so there's a holding pond there now. Let's kick this snowball into one of them. Gonna build a couple holding ponds here. Crap, I'm gonna do that one. I'm probably gonna fill all of these holding ponds in eventually too. It's this is literally just for this objective here. I don't actually want all these stupid holding ponds. Crap. At least round it out though, just to make it look pretty for the time being. Alright, so now we have lots of little holding ponds. Um, all in the same little area. Commencing wrap up. Alright. Watch, there, there still won't be anything in any of them, but. <laughs> at least they're there now, I guess. This sucks. I'll go inside Nook's Cranny and come back out, see if I can reset the landscape here. Maybe I'm not catching them because I haven't thrown them up. Throw them up there. Goldfish. Popeye goldfish, Ranchu goldfish. That's what I'm on a hunt for. <laughs> so this episode, I've been on the hunt for the mole, uh, cricket, and these two goldfish. The Popeye goldfish. Oh, there's one. 
Alright, alright, now we're having some luck. Fresh stocked pond here. Come on, baby. So there's a regular goldfish. I thought I heard a balloon. Nothing in this pond. Jesus. There's nothing in any of these freaking ponds. I'll check this um this one too. To be safe. There's something over here. <laughs> Crap. Seriously, though? For real? Crap. I'm just gonna wait to see if this thing turns around now. Come on, baby. Turn into me. Alright, now turn into me. There we go. Ta -da, ta -da, ta -da. Another goldfish. We're catching all the freaking regular goldfish, but there are two different kinds of goldfish that I need, and regular goldfish isn't one of, or e isn't either of them. But I wasted some time on that. I found some old or uh, treasures. <laughs> Uh, I'm listening, sure. Yeah, I'll take it. Now I can get rid of this curse. I mean cherished item. Oh, boy. Adios, nostalgia. I love Pietro. He's great. Anyway, back to the hunt for these goldfish. Boom, there's one. Come on, baby. Come on, baby, give it to me. Another freaking regular goldfish. Oh my god. I uh, I have to look away, you might notice. I have to look away when I'm fishing. Because I get so twitchy, and every time it go it goes in, it like builds like anticipation. And I tweak out, and I'm more likely to uh, accidentally pull it in too soon. I like look away, and I... Uh, a sweet fish? Oh, pond smell. Um, I have to look away and just like listen for the bite. I don't know why. It's just I've just found that to work better for me. So if you're like me and you're like really spaz, you really spaz out when it comes to uh, now the freaking mole crickets are everywhere. Uh, but if you really tweak out and like spaz and suck at fishing like that, try that. Just try listening for it. Because the sound paired with the, um, the movement of the fish darting towards you, for me, is, like, too much. <laughs> Crap, even, mm, I blew it. See, I, I'm still a spaz, though. I, I hate, I mean, I love fishing, but it's not as relaxing as it should be. I mean, it is when it's just, you're, you're just fishing and it doesn't matter, but like when you're looking for something specific and you're like, oh, this could be it, based on the shadow size and everything, this could be the fish I'm looking for, and then you reel it in and, you know, you know if you, if you miss it and you blow the opportunity, then you're really blowing an opportunity when there's that kind of pressure on it. <laughs> I, I suck at it and I hate it. So let me go in here, reset the map outside, sell whatever crap I already caught. I might I might end with just this mole cricket. Oh my god, I gave Bunny that that mask. <laughs> Those glasses. That's great. I gave that to Bunny like a while ago. I didn't think she would actually wear it though. So we're selling lots of goldfish, bud. And this alto saxophone. I don't really need it. And that, and that, and that. Pretty much everything that everybody gave me. 
and this hardwood tree. Nah, I'll keep that. But I'll sell those babooshes. Nine thousand four hundred and eighty bells for all of that. It's not that much at all. Thanks so much, much. Okay, so we're gonna go back out here. We got. We just hit the thirty-minute mark, approximately here in this episode. So, uh, we'll give it one more go here, and then we'll continue the hunt next week here. Maybe I'll switch it up, uh, cause I had to catch that blowfish. So maybe I'll do a night, um, or an evening episode. No, it is a night. It's like from nine to nine p.m. to four a.m. or something like that, right? They're available. The blowfish. So I'll have to pull a bit of a night adventure. The dung beetle over there. Pull a bit of a night adventure for the next episode, cause I gotta get this blowfish before uh, it goes away in March, or else I'm screwed for the next year. Come on, baby. You jerk. I'm just gonna sit. That dung beetle just pushed that snowball into the water over there. <laughs> I didn't even know they could or would do that. Okay. It's crunch time. Got it. Come on, baby. Another freaking regular goldfish. So many goldfish out and about. They must be worthless, too, because they didn't Or close to worthless. Let me take a lap or something. I don't know. But I'm not in the market for whatever you are. Trying to scare this stupid fish away. There we go. Okay, so still nothing. Oh, here we go. Now we're talking. Now we're talking. In the heart pond. Let's do it. Come on. Another bitterling. So this is just a bitterling pond over here. I think I caught... The only two fish I've caught in that heart pond so far have been bitterling. Ooh, there's a big boy. I wonder if because those uh, ponds are in such close proximity, they'll only ever spawn one fish at a time. I don't know. So next episode, I'll try to I'll look at the time windows. I'll definitely be going for that blowfish, but I'll look at the time windows and see um, what time of day I'll have the best opportunity to catch any number of the fish that I need to catch still. Uh, let me run inside real quick. I wish somebody was at the campsite so I could just run inside the campsite. Or inside the tent there and uh, reset the map that way, but I have to... Gotta run back into the store here and run back out. And this will be where I sign off for the day. Unlucky. Well, I mean, uh, it wasn't a complete waste. I definitely caught that mole cricket, thank god. So the mole cricket is done. Maybe I should have... Nah, I was gonna say, maybe I should have started with one of the other ones, but... <laughs> then I would have had nothing to show for this episode. Just trying to scare this big boy away. Look at it! Look at it! Haha, <laughs> get out of here. 
So yeah, it seems like only one fish really sp spawns at that pond uh, at a time. Which would make sense if it's if it's all considered one pond, it would make sense that that would only show two or one at a time. Oh, but maybe, maybe if I go on uh, a Nook Mile Island, I won't do that now, but... Ooh, right off the bat. Come on, baby. Here it is. Another freaking regular goldfish, dude. Got all the freaking regular goldfish, but that's not the kind of goldfish I need. Give me one of them snacks that smile back. <laughs> need a real... Need a Popeye goldfish or a Ranchu goldfish. Ranchu! Okay, um... Yeah, it seems like I'm, I'm kind of out of luck here. So this is where we'll sign off for the day. Thank you so much for tuning in. Tune in next week when we will continue our quest. Uh, definitely for the blowfish. And maybe for more of these goldfish and stringfish. But let me run back. I, I just I hate giving up. Uh, but I am the Nintendo Beast. Like I said... Um, what was that? Nothing? Nothing. Tiger Beetle. Uh, I am the Nintendo Beast. I I'm actually going to sign off this time, I swear to God. I'm actually... Any fish over here? No. I'm actually signing off. <laughs> Put my controller down. I, gotta, I can't do this all day. Uh, I am the Nintendo Beast. Like I said three times now. Uh, if you enjoyed this video and if you love Animal Crossing as much as I do, make sure to subscribe ring that bell for notifications when I go live, when I upload new video content to the channel, and like this, and so much more. Uh, new episodes of my ongoing Animal Crossing Let's Play series uh, on GameCube, on the Wii, now uh, Wild World from the DS, but being played on the Wii U, and of course, Animal Crossing New Horizons here on the Nintendo Switch. New episodes premiere every Sunday here on the channel. So like I said, if you love Animal Crossing, lots of Animal Crossing content here on the Nintendo Beast channel. But for the fourth, maybe the fifth, maybe the hundredth time, who knows, uh, I am the Nintendo Beast. Thanks for watching.